Hello. Uh, for those of you who missed the introduction to the Christian writings of Kim Friesen, um, just uh, click on the link above and it will take you to the uh, introduction. Thank you. Welcome to the Christian writings of Kim Friesen. And she writes, when the Son of Man comes, will he find faith on the earth? I have often pondered these words. Jesus did not say, when I return, will I find my disciples preaching the gospel? For we know by reading scripture that the end will not come till the gospel has been preached in the whole world, it says in Matthew 24, 14. Nor did he say, will I find my children serving the poor? We know from the word of God that Jesus also said, the poor you will always have with you. Matthew 26, 11. He did not say, will the believers be visiting the sick and those who suffer in prison? Or will they love one another as I have loved the world? It says in Matthew 25, 35 and 36. Why then the question about faith? We know that without faith, it is impossible to please God, it says in Hebrews eleven six. Was the dream I had about faith some time later a gift to help me see more clearly as I pondered this question the Lord had asked? In the dream, I saw the Lord behind me facing the world and his people before him. And I heard him say, what pitiful faith this is. No wonder the will and full counsel of God is left undone. I felt that the disciples must have felt this when Jesus, troubled by their lack of faith, had exclaimed, O ye of little faith, how long must I be with you? Luke 9, 41. In the dream, the Lord took out from among the people one person at the time and suspended him or her between heaven and earth. The ones that were lifted up had one thing in common. They had gone through many trials and had learned to have no confidence in their own strength. Out of himself, he then took his own faith and placed it inside the person who is lifted up, who became white as if in a glorified state. I then heard the Lord said, it is good. Now the full counsel of the Lord will be done, for it will be done by my zeal and because of my faith. I awoke and remembered the prayers that quite by no merit of my own had begun to arise in my soul, and I thought I would share them in case as prayers go up for God to lift up and cause the army of God to arise, others would be led to join with me that together we might pray in one accord for the glory of God. The Christian writings of Kim Friesen. Thank you, Jesus, and thank you, Kim.